we are getting there i think i may actually be wrapping it up after this next day i think this next day will be my last for the stream for today i'm not sure what to do kind of want to just keep playing but i also have some stuff i probably need to do around the house the usual problem i just want to play just want to play I need to finish The Last of Us 2, Doom Eternal, Divinity Original Sin 2, Days Gone, Nuka World DLC. I want to play games like the older Fallout games, first Red Dead Redemption, etc, etc. Is Fallout, I, I always ask you this, is Fallout 4 the only one you've played, Rebecca? What are you up to today, Starf? How's your day going? All right, let's grab that. That, get out of here. Rabbits. Rabbits and twigs once we're, once we're back. Once we're back. Rabbits and twigs. Rabbits and twigs. Fallout 4 and DLC is cool. Cool, cool. One rabbit, two rabbit, three rabbits, four rabbits. My day's been great. Do you have any special plans today, uh, Starf? Anything you got going on or just a chill day or? I think the only thing I got going today, I've got games to play. I got a run to get in later. Um, I'm gonna hang out with my dogs. We're already recorded some uh, Fallout today, so that was good. Let's just do these three and then call it good. I think there's no way we could ever use the actual total amount of poop that we have. Maybe we should just start using more poop as uh, fertilizer, or as uh, as fuel for the fire. That's what we gotta do. Just a chill day today. Gotcha. Where are you from? If you don't mind me asking. Did we? Did I ask you this last time, Starf? Flower, by the way. Yo, a hound's tooth. Two hound's teeth. That's super useful. Let's go. Ooh, there's another one. Are there more teeth? Just the meat. Just the meat. Alright. Let's get home. Let's make love. Pop that on, pop that on. Let's go. Okay. Um, there are at least several new games I'm looking forward to. At least four, five games. What what new games are you looking to that mu uh, that much? Dang. Okay, uh, we can make a hound trap, which would be nice. Where is that? Two trap requires rope, which I think we have in here or down here. Yeah, there we go. I think I can actually make a second one too. I can make a second one. All right. We are getting there. Let's 
do that. Throw it in here because I'm not actually going to use it. Make another one. Nope, 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 nope. Beautiful. All right, uh, time to probably get some wood. Let's do it. Cyberpunk 2077, that's right. Watchdogs Legion, which I've never heard of. Dying Light, Baldur's Gate, and Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Valhalla is the one uh, that's like Scandinavian themed, right? I'm going to have to learn what, what everybody's so excited for Cyberpunk for. I, uh, I haven't looked at the, like, any trailers or anything, but I've just heard, I've heard it so often from so many people. Beautiful. Okay, we are getting there. It's the Vikings invading New England. Probably the most anticipated game. Cyberpunk, yeah. Which which kinda is like I don't know a ton about about game development and stuff, but like to me it, it never seems like a, a positive thing. Sorry, I should rephrase that. To me it seems sometimes like a less positive thing when a game has super is super uh anticipated. Because I just feel like it sometimes raises expectations. What is Cyberpunk? A video game, Cyberpunk 2070, 2077 is a video game that's going to be coming out that Rebecca and I think Lost 2 is also excited for. I don't know a thing about it though. Uh, can I get to this guy? I can. Okay. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what to do tomorrow? Always the question in this game. What to do tomorrow? Go down here and just do the rest of that. It's tough. I really don't have a lot of exploring I could do again. If I did that, there's some twigs to get along the way. One, two, three, four, five. Some twigs to get along the way. Maybe that's what I'll do. I don't even know what type of game Cyberpunk 2077 is. Like, I don't know if it's an RPG, if it's a... Yo, I don't know where I put my phone. Did I leave it downstairs? I might have left it downstairs. Do you have a mode or something? Just ask. I don't know what that means, Starf. I don't know what you mean. Yo, where's my phone? Oh well, I think I probably left it downstairs, so I don't know if, uh... Oh, Megan hasn't tried to call me or anything. Cyberpunk is cool and all, but I do have the mindset that, uh, I'm not getting too hyped for a game. Yeah, I feel like it's tough for the game when you do that. There was that one time I got hyped for No Man's Sky, but yeah. Yup. It's a good example. Uh, we were gonna go down. Is that the trailer, Rebecca? I'll have to watch it off stream. Or uh, after after we're done. Here. Get 
it's mostly just that I feel like games should be hyped when you start playing it kind of thing. Yeah, I mean, I am in agreement. I think, like, a game, the best way... This is anything, by the way. Anything that gets released. Um, like, you... It's so much better for the game's sake and for everyone else's sake if the excitement comes from the actual playing of it and not what you think it might be, you know? I'm hyped anyway. If there's one company I respect and trust, it's CD Projekt Red. Gotcha. Ooh, I forgot that we probably already picked up all of the sticks over here. Yep. Looks sort of like it. We have some rot, which is useful. Let's go left. Let's, let's grab all these sticks and then get out of here. It's tough to avoid getting excited. I know what you mean, Lost. Bush hat. I think we got all the sticks out of here already. Shit. Well, I could go around to the left. Graphics looking shiny. Game mechanics looking crazy. Ooh, buddy. Ooh, buddy. Ooh, buddy. All right, sticks. Sticks, and I know I can't see anything, but where are you? Twigs, whatever they're called. What's up, dude? My pig man has no house. All right, let's go for those three, and then we'll get out of here. Right there. Those right there, right there. And right there. All right. Beautiful. I'm trying to think if there's any other games I'm hyped for. I don't know, really. I, And part of this, I think, too, is that I like am still so behind on games that, like, I don't know if uh, I don't know if I know enough to be excited yet, but I don't know. So many of the games that I like, I played in beta anyway, so it's like I don't know. One thing I'm really excited about with 2077 is the replayability of the game. You can play it many different ways. It does have said you could play the game without firing a single shot if you wanted to. Apparently, there's ways to do that in Fallout. By the way, did you know that? We have this really crazy, uh, insane smart viewer on, um, on YouTube who keeps, uh, giving me, like, little tidbits of information about how, uh, about how different people play Fallout differently. Um, and one of the ways is you can do, like, a pacifist run, apparently. I don't know. It's insane. It's insane to me. That seems very difficult. That's exciting, Rebecca. Yeah. Especially if you love a game, you get to spend more time in the world. It's great. I fall... <laughs> I know we've talked about Fallout so much today, but like one of the crazy things about Fallout is how large it is and I just can't imagine going going and finding all these different ways to play it again, you know? Just because I don't feel like I really have done uh, well enough. Actually, let's just go some more. I don't really feel like I've done well enough in my own playthrough. There's still so many things I haven't experienced the first time around, you know? It's so large. And I've recorded like, uh, we figured out today I've recorded like 100 and, I've recorded 90 hours of, of total Fallout gameplay, I think. It's like 180 episodes. This is the same company that made The Witcher. Cool. 
Cool. Oh, we do have extra wood. Okay. Beautiful. All right. Hmm. What to do here? I love games you can spend hundreds of hours on. Yeah, it's really cool. It's very neat. Okay, um, let's take a look here. Do you have poop in there? So let's stop using poop now. Let's start using wood. Extra wood on the fire. Can you make a golden spear? Doesn't look like it. Oh, there's a couple of them. Oh, shit. I didn't know there was this one, too. Starve. I, uh... I appreciate the comments, man, but please stop trying to hint at what's coming, okay? I appreciate the comments. Thank you. I've made it past day 33 before. <laughs> So RC, what's the, what was it called? CD Project Red has made, also made The Witcher. Okay. What's the plan for tomorrow? Could go get some more rabbits. I feel like we're really just like... When was the Witcher, Witcher released? I don't know. Everything I see about the Witcher is about that nude scene in the, like, bathtub. Is there a nude scene in the bathtub in the, uh, in the Witcher? I think that's... I think that's a thing. Let's go get rabbits. Could always use more rabbits. Sanity do be low, though. All right. In the very beginning, there's a nude scene. Yeah, that's what I thought. I didn't know where it was, but... I like I haven't here's the thing about the witcher's nude scene. I haven't played the game I don't know anything about the witcher I don't even know what type of game it is, but I know about this nude scene because it's so memeable. It's so memed I've seen it all over the internet Also, let's laugh at the fact that I said 30 minutes ago that I was gonna be done and uh, Now here we are 30 minutes later I'm getting hungry, but I don't want to stop because I'm having so much fun. The base game was released in 2015. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. You know, you'd think that the rabbits in Don't Starve would start getting smarter, you know? Like, they watch every single one of their family members fall to the same type of trap. Over and over again. And yet, every time they see a basket on a stick, they think, huh, I wonder what's, hear me out, underneath the basket. Let's go see. And then when the whole thing starts wiggling, they think, uh-oh, I better not move. Despite that being exactly what all of my family members did in order to die. And here we are.
All right. <clears throat> Let's get warmed up. And keep things rolling. Hmm. All right, we're good on wood. I really think we're just kind of chilling at this point. The thing is, we can't explore very far. But we're good on wood. We have even gotten some bear extra berry bushes this year. Like, we could go dig up a couple graves. Look, if you see your friends get kidnapped by a giant and the trap is a pepperoni pizza, do you think you would not fall for it? I think I would. Listen. We're not talking pepperoni pizza, because that changes everything. If there's a pepperoni pizza waiting for me, I'm falling for the freaking trap. Of course. But I'm not even putting out pepperoni pizza. I'm not even putting anything. Apples and oranges here, you know? <laughs> All right. I think it's this point, it's just kind of a waiting game. Okay, so we've done... We've done this, we've done this, uh... This one, and it takes us all the way up there. What we haven't done is this one. Exp we should explore the, the up wormhole. Have we done down wormhole? Down wormhole being this one? Wormhole down? Question mark? I don't remember if we have. Maybe in that world, the rabbits love baskets. They do look kind of cozy, to be honest. You know what? You're not wrong. They do be looking kind of cozy, though. All right. I'm going to see if there's anything else I can craft while I'm just sitting here. I don't think we have any checkered flooring. We've never come up with any of the... We also have a cave we could eventually do. So, what's up, man? Uh, bird trap, compass. Piggyback. Honey poultice. Can't do that. Makes a bunny puff. Tent. Under my umbrella, Ella, Ella, a a. Uh, we could do a net, dude. We've we've actually needed to do a net for a while. Um, no, we can't do a net because we don't have enough spiders web things. It says I'm still alive. Hey, hey, how are you feeling with the? How are you feeling today? What's the worst that can happen? What's the worst that could happen? I, f uh, I feel like a, a bag of smashed assholes. That, I don't know a lot about smashed assholes, but seems no bueno overall to me. I don't know, if I had to guess, that seems like a no bueno. I could actually make one of those bush hats if I had an extra bush. There are a couple things I can make with rope, I believe. Seb's headed back to bed. I think that sounds like a smart plan.
Lost, is that your favorite candy? Is Toblerone? Toblerone. I don't, actually don't know how to say that either. Toblerone. You know what let's do? Let's make a farm. Let's make ourselves a farm. Beautiful. Is it going to do literally anything during the winter? No, it ain't. Does that matter? No, it don't. Rebecca's off. I'm going to go play some video games, take my sleeping pills, and sleep away this crappy day. Thanks for making me feel a lot better, though. Rebecca, it was so good to get to hang out with you today. Love you very much. Thanks for being here. Law says it's a nice bar of chocolate. I think I've seen them, like, at the airport. You know? I think that's where I've seen them. Mm-mm-mm. Better one takes just a little bit more grass. Okay. Chat, when did winter end last time we played? I don't remember. Don't remember. Got that good rot. All right. Let's think here. I think we could probably explore that upper right-hand corner real quick. Don't forget to grab our thermal stone. Grab our hat. Get on with it. Cadbury's are good, too. And kinder bueno. What is kinder bueno? In terms of chocolate, I'm a huge fan of, like... Twix. Twix is great. Um, Butterfinger, which isn't really chocolate, but it's got chocolate in it. Um, Butterfingers are awesome. Snickers are really good. Snickers are underrated. Very underrated. Winter ends on day 36. Okay, good to know. We're basically there. It's exciting. That means tomorrow when we start, uh, we'll have a... We'll have a... Clean slate. Okay, we got some stuff there. This is the end of this. And now we know. We know right where the end of that is. I'd say if I had to say like something with chocolate, Kinder Bueno is the best. Kinder Bueno is like a waferish bar with hazelnut cream inside. Hazelnut cream. That sounds great. You guys are making me hungry now. You guys are making me very hungry. Very hungry. Oh, dude, we had a we had a rabbit thing over here. Didn't know that. Sinkers are very good, yeah. I think they're like they're very common here, so I think that's part of why they're not super uh, well loved, just how common they are. But I still think they're pretty freaking great. Alrighty. Dead rabbit. Easy. Toss that sucker down. Nope, no rot in you. Actually, we are going to put that in there. That way, we can put the poop out of here. Actually, put that there. That way we can do it if... uh. We run into anything. Okay. Could use more wood. Could definitely use more wood. Nothing is better than bread and salami. 
Man, I don't know about that. I can think of lots of things better than bread and salami. Have you had pizza recently? Bread and salami. There's nothing wrong with salami. I don't know that it's my favorite, though. Okay, look at that shit. We've done it. Uh, do that. Alright. Sometimes you want that chocolatey caramel, caramel, nougat, chewiness with the bunch of peanut goodness. Oh, surprise. Thank you so very much. I'll give me, I'll give you two seconds, okay? One second. Surprise says I have class in four minutes, but I wanted to say, hey. All right, bye. All right, see you, surprise. Thanks, man. All right, we are actually going to call it right there. We survived winter, basically. We're doing it. We have a really good setup. Like, we're actually running out of stuff to do. That's how ahead we are right now. Um, and don't starve. We're actually going to have to stop uh, right there and, and pop back in next time, though. Uh, pop back in next time ready to ready to kick some butt. So, uh, let's go ahead and throw that in one of the storage things. Let's throw this in here. And we'll call it there. Beautiful. Thanks so much for watching this episode of our Don't Starve Let's Play series. If you liked what you saw, I would really appreciate a like underneath the video. Otherwise, we'll see you tomorrow for more Don't Starve. Bye-bye.